Grunfeld defense, exchange variation, 5.e4 nxc36. bxc3 bg77. b3c58. qd2. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Opening with the queen's pawn. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the knight, rather than a pawn. By taking control of the crucial d5 square and creating a space on which the knight can move to c3 without obstructing the c-pawn, move c4 helps to create a strong center. With the help of the king's Indian defense, white can get ready to develop the bishop to g7 and create a powerful center that black will later try to damage. And c3 prepares the e2 e4 pawn push and helps control the d5 square. The Grunfeld defense uses this pawn push to gain space in the center and attack the c4 pawn. Cx d5 opens up the center, after black recaptures with nx d5, white is prepared to answer with e2 e4. nx d5 recaptures the d5 pawn and places the knight in the center, where it controls many important squares. e4 takes full control of the center and attacks the knight on d5. nx c3 trades the attack knight, and gives white a large center that black will attempt to attack. bxc3 recaptures the knight and supports the d4 pawn. Fianchetto move bg7 places the bishop on the long diagonal. b3 develops the bishop toward the center and supports the d4 pawn. c5 takes space in the center, attacks the d4 pawn, and tempts white to capture the c5 pawn after which black can play bxc3 plus, forking the white king and rook. QD2 develops the queen and supports the bishop on e3 and the pawn on c3. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Backs off. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. The pawn is now adequately defended. It is the last book move. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. It is best. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. It is ideal. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. That's good. This develops a bishop off its starting square, getting it into the action. This threatens to kick a knight. It is best. The rook is now on an open file, which helps control squares across the board. It is quite good. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. This threatens to kick a bishop. It is best. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. That's good. The opposing bishop is kicked by a pawn, and must now move or be captured. It is best. This exchange is fair. It is quite good. A better technique to recapture a piece is missed by this. It is incorrect. This maintains the balance in material with a good trade. It is best. Backs off. This poses a threat to strike a knight. It is ideal. Among the best actions. It is quite good. That's a decent move. That's good. This buys time by putting a rook in danger and getting it to flee. It is quite good. The rook is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Recaptures. It is ideal. This defends the attacked pawn. It is excellent. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. As a result, the rooks are placed in a single file and are able to cooperate to pose a danger. It is ideal. That's fine. It is good. The pawn is now in a safe position. That's good. That's a decent move. That's good. That is a logical response. It is quite good. This is an equal trade. It is best. Backs off. It is ideal. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. 
a solid choice. It is excellent. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is excellent. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is quite good. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. It is quite good. This reveals an attack on a rook. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is best. This provides an equal exchange of parts. It is quite good. This creates a threat to win a pawn. It is good. This exposes an attack, threatening a rook. This is the only good move. It is a great move. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. This offers to exchange pieces of equal value. It is excellent. Balanced neither player ever had an advantage. That game was pretty competitive. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players.